Hey there, and welcome to your Divine Soulmate check-in. Divine Soulmate, Divine Counterpart, could be Twin Flame, somebody that you have been feeling, somebody that you've been calling in, um, your significant soulmate that's coming in. Uh, let's see how they're feeling. It might be somebody you're already thinking of, you know, and you're just not in a completely committed relationship yet, okay? So if you're thinking of somebody or you've been feeling or you've just been calling in somebody then, you know, and this resonates with you, then it's for you. If it doesn't resonate with you, then it's not the right video for you, okay? So it doesn't mean that it's for everyone, okay? So uh, if it resonates for you, yay, you know, if it makes sense. And if it doesn't, then, you know, try another video, I guess, okay? So I'm just going to shuffle here and get going. And um, my table's a little wonky tonight, so... All right, I was already shuffling the deck a whole bunch, and let's just ask for the right message to come through for the, for the right person, just the, the message that supports them and helps them to, to move forward on this journey, to give them confirmation, to build up that love, and just to grow that love within you, grow that love within you, and that love connection, because everything happens out there in the energetic field before it happens in, in our physical vessel, you know, the ones that we can, in the 3D, right? So everything happens in the energetic realms before it happens. I mean, you might be thinking that you just like a relationship or maybe, you know, that you're ready for one or maybe you've actually seen them, you know, in your mind or know they're coming or maybe you've been to readers and they've told you they're coming or maybe it's somebody you've already met and you're like, mm, there's something special about this person, right? And, and maybe they feel like home and uh, yeah so anyways I'm all about the love I love it so all right let's pick out three cards to yeah to give us a message here on on what what uh, what is going on with our divine counterpart oh wow <gasps> oh, holy smokes okay first of all I just want to say that this is the Light Seer's Tarot. So that is, oh, I don't know if it's backwards on the screen. Oh, well. It's the Light Seer's Tarot. That's the deck. First card that came out was a magician. They're actually calling you in. They've been calling you in for a while. I just got the truth bumps running up and down me. They've been calling you in for a while, okay? They know what they want. They can feel it. They can actually feel you. I mean, maybe they don't know what you look like. Maybe they do. I mean, I've had visions where I've seen people, what they look like, and I know who they're going to be in my life. I just didn't know their names, right? This person knows how to work energy. I mean, they may not know it consciously, but they know how to put it out there. They know how to manifest. They know how to pray. They know how to ask for what they want. They know what they don't want anymore, okay? And what they do want is you, all right? So this person is literally going in here and creating the relationship that they want. They're going in and creating how it's going to look, how it's going to feel, what it's going to be like. They're making their list and checking it twice, okay? And so, and you're on their list. Mm. And you're on their nice list. Maybe on their naughty list, too. <laughs> well, if you're lucky. <laughs> All right. Ah, so here's the cool thing. The second card that came out. By the way, this is a tarot deck, right? This is a major arcana card. This is fate. This is definitely, there's no getting around this. This is happening, okay? The second card that came out is the fool. The fool. The fool. Do you know what the fool means? It's not foolish. The fool knows how to let go and take chances. The fool has been there, done that, seen things, and they're tired of hiding. They're tired. They're so tired of holding back. Okay? And they're ready just to let go and take that leap of faith. All right? Look at her right there. You can't see what's in her hand, but look at her. She's hanging on to like a piece of fabric here, and then she's getting ready to let go and just dive down into this beautiful, beautiful area down here all lit up, you know? The Fool is a great card because that means that your divine counterpart, your divine soulmate, you know, the, the one that you've been calling in, the one that maybe you've already seen or, or know is in your life, they're ready. They're ready to take that leap of faith. They're thinking about it, they're ready, and they're gonna do it, okay? That leap of faith. 
and then the third card. You're welcome. <laughs> the third card is the Two of Cups. And actually, this is one of my favorite cards in this deck. That's why I love this deck so much, is the imagery on these cards. I'm trying to get this without the glare of the light. You see the Two of Cups, how, how the two hands come together and entwined, and all this energy is coming down and filling up those cups. So each one of these hands has their own energy. Each one has their own cup. And together, they fill it up even more, and even the different colors coming down there, and how beautiful that is. The Two of Cups is all about love. It's all about love coming in. It's all about love flowing. It's all about love, you know, doing the dance, you know, the way the hands dance there together for that. It's all about the divine love coming in and being real and being there. The other thing I pick up off this card for you is, you know, get a pen here to it out. And so you can see the energy coming down. You see, that's because it's in the energetic realms before it shows up down into the bowls, before they fill up both bowls, the side by side, you know, intertwined. So you can look at this as a, this is what's happening in the energy realms that you're reaching out to each other. Maybe you've been having dreams of each other. You know, maybe you've been calling one another in. Maybe you've already met and there was an attraction and you're thinking about each other. You think, you know, oh, I sure hope I run into him again or, you know, maybe I should call her or something like that, right? And while you're doing that, you're building that energetic love stream to the other person and then back to you, okay? So what's happening is it's happening in the energetic realms, and there it is as it fills up the cups. Love. Love, love, love. Okay? So, let's see if we can get all three of these up. Here, whoop, turn that one around. Here is what is going on with your divine counterpart, with your divine soulmate, with, you know, could be a twin flame relationship. I don't know. However it speaks to you, if it resonates, if it makes sense, Use it to help you on your journey, to open up your heart, to receive more love, to give more love, to be, to be patient, to be patient while the fool jumps. That sounds so hard. While the fool jumps. To be patient because they are manifesting you, okay? They are manifesting you. And, and I just got the truth bumps running up and down. It's happening. It's like game on, okay? All right, what a fantastic reading. What a fantastic reading. You know, let me know what you think of it in the comments. And, you know, if you like it, give it a like. You know, subscribe to the channel. Um, I'm growing my channel. And share it with somebody who needs to hear it. You know, if, if, if you know somebody who needs some, some confirmation when you think of this, I don't believe in coincidences, okay? So if you are watching this, and it doesn't have to be today when I post it, it could be a year from now, it could be three years from now, who cares? Whatever time that you're seeing it and it makes sense to you and it's speaking to you, it's because it is speaking to you, you know? One thing that I know is that we get messages. We get messages from the divine. We get messages from the energy that we align with, okay? And if, if this reading is resonating with you, if it's making sense to you, if it's helping you, then it was sent to you. You, you have a... You had the soul's desire to hear this message, and so it came in on the frequency that you are. Okay? And what a great frequency with the magician, the fool, and two of cups. All right? So, yay you. All right. Well, you have a great day, and I will see you on the next video. Bye.